we would like to give a special thanks to Girls & Co. for providing us with these dolls. Today on Unbox Daily, we are taking a look at Girls & Co. dolls. On their website, it says that these are dolls for the next generation of leaders. This is a doll and story series centered around one, two, three, four, five, six, seven characters who are described as being diverse, ambitious, and smart. When I looked on their website, I saw a current retail price of $88. Each doll comes with a book, stickers, and a bracelet. Ooh, I like that. This book is called The Brookies Build a Business. And on the very first sentence, it says, on rainy days, we get crafty. So yeah, I'm gonna have to read that. And the stickers are pretty cute. There is one for girl power. We have some boxing gloves. Who runs the world? Girls, hashtag no filter. And I'm loving this little emoji. All right, on to the dolls. We have two of the seven friends with us today and they both came in purple traveling cases. There is a handle on the side, a little window, and a zipper on the side. This is my first time seeing this doll. I am very excited to share this with all of you. I can see what I think is a name on a card. Kara? This is one of the characters from the book and on the back there is some information about her. She is the CEO of Brookie's Bracelets. <gasps> That's where the bracelet came from. That is so cute. Her birthday is in May. She likes crafting. Her favorite subject is social studies and her favorite food is breakfast sandwiches. Career goals? Entrepreneur. That is awesome. So let's go ahead and remove Kara from the carrying case. She comes wrapped in plastic. So we have to remove that. Netting is used to protect the hair. And she is ready to go. That was a pretty easy unboxing. What do you say we unbox the other one? Unjelly. She is the product designer for Brookie's bracelets. Her birthday is in April. Her hobbies are acting, singing, writing songs, and playing the guitar. I wish I knew how to play the guitar. She is inspired by films that tell stories that often go untold. And one day she hopes to act in movies or direct her own. Okay, so let me get this straight. She wants to own her own business and she wants to direct movies. <laughs> These girls have some awesome career goals. Both dolls are wearing a dress. This one is a light cream color with gold metallic hearts. And here we have a black and white striped top with a colorful skirt. The fabric has a little stretch and it Velcros in the back. They are wearing flat faux leather shoes with a little bow on the front. They are about 18 inches tall, can be balanced to stand on their own. They have the basic five points of articulation with movement at the head, shoulder, and hip. And I really like their head movement because they can tilt their head from side to side. They can look up and they can look down. And being able to adjust the head like that really does give the doll a lot of personality. Yeah! For the most part, this is a vinyl doll with vinyl at the neck and around the collar. However, starting at the top of the ribs, the rest of the torso is soft. They have inset eyes that close when the doll is laying down and open when she is sitting up. The hair is rooted and it is a nice quality. It is very soft.
quality is very important to me because if this is a doll that is going to be used for active play, then usually the hair is the first thing that starts to wear out. So I appreciate it when the doll's hair is good to go right out of the box. I have a great idea. Does it involve unihamsters? What's a unihamster? Mythical creatures from the land of Enchantia that disguise themselves as everyday hamsters. Or at least, that's what I'm writing in my new script. Well, while we're waiting for that to become the next best thing since Harry Potter, what do you say we start a bracelet business? What a great idea! And we can add unihamster charms! I like your thinking. And I think playing is so important, whether you stick with the character storylines or create your own. You can look for these dolls on their website. We will put the link down below. And we'll see you tomorrow for another Unbox Daily. And that's our collection for now.